A congregation in Putnam County is vowing to rebuild after a massive fire destroyed their church this morning. You watched it as breaking news right here on RTV6. Firefighters had to fight the flames while battling Mother Nature as well. RTV6's Julie Persley has the latest. A church that took a community years to grow was destroyed within minutes by this massive fire. Uh, I can remember it as a youngster growing up in this area. Flames raced through the Life Springs Church on US 231 north of Greencastle before dawn this morning. It's a very active church in our community, and a lot of people are going to be really sad about this today. A passerby called 911 after seeing smoke. The fire was so large, more than 100 firefighters from Putnam and surrounding counties were called in. One of the biggest challenges for firefighters is the fact that there are no hydrants out in this very rural area. Tanker trucks had to bring in all of the water from neighboring communities. Also, firefighters were working in temperatures below zero throughout the morning. What do you think about all these firefighters who have been out They're here? just impressive. Just awesome to be out here in this kind of weather. And you can't say enough about them. Road crews put down salt since the water was freezing within minutes. Church members and staff say they're appreciative for everyone who works so hard. Praise God that we have the firefighters that we have that were able to come out here and risk their lives and they stayed safe through everything. The sign out front reads, what will you give up to be closer to God? This congregation may have given up a building, but members say they will still stand strong as a church. In Putnam County, Julie Persley, RTV6. And it was so cold today that school buses were even brought in so firefighters could take breaks and warm up. As for the cause, investigators are still trying to figure out what started the fire at Life Spring Church.